हेलो बच्चों तो चलिए हम अपना क्वेश्चन डिस्कस करते हैं यहाँ पे गिवन है इफ सिक्स बॉयज एंड सिक्स गर्ल्स सिट इन अ रो एट रैंडम देन द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट ऑल द गर्ल्स सिट टुगेदर इज ऑप्शन ए है 12 बाय 132 बी है 12 बाय 431 सी है 1 डिवाइडेड बाय 431 एंड डी है नन ऑफ दिस यहाँ पे हमारा की कॉन्सेप्ट है हमारी प्रॉबिलिटी होती है प्रॉबिलिटी इज इक्वल टू फेवरेबल आउटकम्स डिवाइडेड बाय टोटल आउटकम्स अब यहाँ पे यहाँ पे गिवन है सिक्स बॉयज एंड सिक्स गर्ल्स तो टोटल हुआ सिक्स प्लस सिक्स ट्वेल्व फर्स्ट अरेंज सिक्स बॉयज विद विद रिस्पेक्ट टू ईच अदर सो सिक्स बॉयज को अरेंज करना है सिक्स बॉयज Arrange करना है so we can arrange in factorial six days. Okay, total number of possible days to arrange twelve children is factorial twelve days. And to arrange six boys, we have factorial six days. Now, once the boys are arranged with respect to each other, we have to place six girls. So to understand this, let us let us draw one notation. So we let us denote B as boy. So there are six boys. Okay, and we can see that. One, two, three, four, five, six, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So see, B represent the boys whose position has been fixed with respect to each other, and this blank space represent an empty space where the girls can sit. So after arranging the boys, we can see that there are seven places between the boys where all the girls can be placed. Now we have to choose one out of these seven places, and then six girls. So here, for this number of Days to choose one out of seven places is seven C one, which is seven days. Or we have calculated C factorial n divided by factorial r multiplied by factorial n minus r is equal to n C r. Okay. Now number of Ways to arrange six girls is factorial six ways. So here the number of ways in which six boys and Six girls can sit in a row such that all girls sit together is equal to number of 
ways to arrange six boys multiplied by number of space to choose one out of seven multiplied by number of ways to arrange six girls so ye ho jayega factorial 6 multiplied by 7 multiplied by factorial 6 so we can get factorial 6 multiplied by factorial 7 we have multiplied this and this favorable outcome and here we have found the total outcome so finally probability is equal to factorial 7 multiplied by factorial 6 divided by factorial 12 so if we simplify this we get 1 divided by 132 this is our final answer and this final answer hum dekh sakte hain option a se bhi nahi match kar raha b se bhi nahi to hamara option d hamara correct answer hua none of these i hope the concept is clear thank you